Gary Lyons here. Hello, Gaz. Traffic's good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that yeah. bloke, whoever it is responsible for that, crashed his car or hit someone up the bum or whatever. Should never drive uh, again. No, he, Ever. Uh, immediately ejaculated out of the uh, state. state. No, yep. And not allowed back for oh, 10 a, years. Have a spell in the Northern Territory. Uh, why, wouldn't you, why wouldn't you do that on Friday night at 5 I'll tell you. <laughs> Doesn't it just nah, cook our on. joint? Come on. As soon as we have issues going over the West Coast, it just no. completely cooks the whole place. Yeah, and let's and let's cause it so bad. Let's just open a lane in case we need a car to go through there. The tunnel I'm talking about. <laughs> yeah. but not not because there is one, but just in case there is. And then at the end of the tunnel, everyone it's a free for all anyway. So let's just see if we can stuff everyone up for a further 15 kilometres out before we get to the tunnel. That'd be a good idea, I reckon. Did you have a good day, guys? That's nah, great. It's really good driving. It's great. Did you have any issues, Chief? You're a bit closer to the venue. Hello, Jim. Hello, Jim. A little bit of traffic, but I'm up and about looking forward to a oh, good no, game. And you know you what? Are. If it takes my happiness to lift everyone in this box, <laughs> I will do it, Jim. I'm not sure your happiness I'm ready has ever to lifted go. anyone to do anything. I'm ready to go, Jim. <laughs> oh, I know you are. We're I, on that, tonight. I get that sense about you, Chief. Well, it's a bloody good game. Could so be the one. Yep. He'll enjoy that. John O'Brown last night on the footy show, a very in-depth discussion, Gaz, about his uh, decision to retire. And uh, I found it fascinating. Where does he go from here? Ah, oh, mate, he'll, he'll launch himself into a very, very successful media career. But he gets it. That's the other thing. I mean, we've had, we've been fortunate enough to deal with him for look, 10 years. But he just gets the media. Doesn't take himself too seriously. No, no. And uh, God knows that's an issue in uh, the media. So, um, <laughs> no, he'll be, uh, I think he'll be a very good operator. Purple. It's a significant issue. It is. I, mean, right, I think it's close, now become close to the biggest issue. Number one issue. Name names. People that take themselves too oh, seriously. Chief, please. Oh, like names everywhere. Yes. Oh, just turn around. It's just, just quite extraordinary. <laughs> just like, Ernest you, type. Uh, Chief, we're, we're paid to have an opinion and all the rest of it, but your opinion's not going to stop the traffic. No, it's not. Well, let's be brutally honest. It's not going to stop the world turning on its access, uh, Chief. And there are some who think it will. <laughs> they think everyone will go. Who do you think oh. they're talking about, Warrior? Wow. So oh. therefore, Purple, I think he'd be a very good fit for our box because he's got that sort of good feel about him. Yep. So if he's thinking going anywhere other than Triple M, he's uh, making a grave error. Well, you were making a pitch to him last well, night. I, I think that was a negotiation. Any of the four in. slots on the weekend, he, you know, suddenly he's fine. He's with people who get it in a similar way. He and we would have to know the pecking order. <laughs> and that would be made known pretty straight what up. What is the pecking order? He'd sit just behind Duck, probably. <laughs> Those two well, can, they can sort it out. Those boys. It's a pretty How significant pecking order when you think mm. about it. You got the two here, and then you got Duck, the greatest footballer well, you're at the seen, top of the tree, Jim. No, no, we're talking about the big former players. I'm talking about Triple M is the entity on well, football, no, so you... there's no doubt of that. But I'm <laughs> talking about the. Hey, given the, what I've just heard about a half hour ago, that is on the shakiest of ground. Talking about heard? the analysts, shakiest of the game. Should we talk about that now? No, no we'll get to it after the break. Stage. I think I've yeah. heard it too, and I think I'm disturbed. Oh, because I haven't been told. I found out, but I've been told. What were you? I don't like discomfort in this box, but there, there's a <laughs> there's a, Chief, a genuine feeling of discomfort amongst Chief, that's blokes not, that have to work that's together. That's not true. What you just said, you, you actually you love, love discomfort. discomfort. I don't. You, you, you create it this time last you night. Create it. No, I don't. Enjoy it. And you feed I it. I think my you gut it. feel tells me Wolf's getting the raw end of the stick. No doubt about and, that. And uh, something needs to be done. Well, I right. think, Chief, you actually <laughs> thrive on it. No? Of that. all the things that is the thriving on it. After your performance last week, I might have you represent me. If that's all right, Chief. Chief, when you found out about what we will talk about, you were you were gleeful. No, I, I you knew I, it was something we had to talk I about. I thought it was soon. a joke, to be brutally honest. Yeah, actually, so did I. <laughs>